there is a uh, trend, a left anarchist trend. Some people here may be in that group, but I really want to warn you that the criticisms you have of the regime as it was developing, it was very experimental. Um, there's nothing like it in the world where a constitution was made by the indigenous peoples and, made, and gave rights to, hum, to Mother Earth, that it's profound. The fact that we have a year for indigenous languages in the UN this year was Abel Morales. Was his, his, so he's a world leader of indigenous people. He's not simply a Bolivian leader. He belongs to all indigenous peoples. And this is an overthrow of indigenous peoples. Everyone has to support it without any question, without any question at all. And we have to understand that the United States fomented this coup. They've been working on it since 2008, during all the Obama administration, and they finally succeeded. So we have to reverse it. From the time that I was 12, I have been different. Different everywhere that I go. And I'm against any coup, and I'm against imperialism. I think what's happening now in Bolivia is terrible. But at the same time, I have been very critical on many of the policies of these supposedly leftist leaders, like in Venezuela, Nicaragua, including Evo, that we need to criticize. If we still just thinking in things in black and white, the communities that we serve, I just, I know I'm putting here something different, and I'm still anti-imperialism, but I have strong critics against these supposed leaders. Very complicated discussion, obviously, to be continued. <laughs> um, I just want to thank everybody um, for all that you bring. Um, I'm going to introduce Sarah Cargill um, to close our session today, but also to close the, the NWSA conference that some of us have been at. And um, so we have a sound performance now.